still be beautiful people. This is. Guess who's got a dash cam? But enough about that. I'm actually gonna have to be actually driving while I'm talking to you guys on this because I'm driving home now. Home is a couple hours away, so I thought I would knock this out for you. Um, yeah, so I thought this would be fun. We're going on a journey. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna have to actually focus a little bit on this now. Um, we are leaving a like mall type of an area right now, so I just wanted to let you know really quick here. You probably won't be able to see my gorgeous face that much. Um, that's just because uh, it's it's nighttime. It's it's darker out, and I'll be on the intrastate because um, that's how it's uh, what it's called here. Um, but yeah, I thought this would be cool and different. And besides, you don't need to be looking at me. What I'm saying has way more importance and value to you than, um, what do you call it, um, than looking at me, the video, jeez. So I might try to put like some more like uh, pictures in on this one or something, but oh, would you please go? Sorry, this car in front of me is just, oh, it's gotta be a grandma. You, you gotta be a grandma. Please be a grandma or else I'm gonna be a little upset. At your driving skills there Paco no offense to anyone named Paco but yes I, I I used to do motivational Mondays all the time motivational Mondays are officially starting back up again so I'm really excited to be doing that um, I really didn't know how much that that motivational Mondays actually meant to you guys um, so I, I'm really glad to be back and it's already dark gosh sorry guys this is as good as it gets um, so dealing with depression I know so dealing with depression, I myself have never personally struggled with depression, like actually having a clinical, like a clinically dosed or prescribed or however you want to look at it, I have never had depression. I have never been uh, like severely like depressed. Now obviously things, times get depressing um, and you do get like depressed every now and then, things like that. Um, wow, this is really shaking. I'm thinking like definitely gonna put some pictures in on this one. <laughs> there are some ways here of depression, of ways that you can handle it. Now I understand if you actually have like a, a problem and I don't mean it like a problem like, oh, you you know, you're, you're just a horrible person. You need to get that checked out. But yeah, you, you need to get that checked out. Now, you should be seeing a doctor for things like that. I, I agree with that. That's something that you need to be making, uh, that you need to stay on top of, uh, that you need to talk to some people about that. Now, what I do to get out of like having those kind of moments in, like, in my mind mentally, and I understand it's different if you actually struggle with depression, uh, but how, how you could potentially help that. And again, I'm not a doctor. I'm just a stupid person on the stupid internet making this stupid video. But you have to think, whenever you actually get upset about stuff, and this isn't with people just with depression, this could be with anyone ever, whenever you actually get upset over something, please ask yourself why. Why am I upset right now? Why am I depressed? What is it really? And think about a week from now, will I be depressed from this? A year from now, will I be depressed from this? And I know a lot of you are going to say, well, yeah, like my dog died or or someone else really close to me, like some kind of a human died. Uh, yeah, that's obviously really depressing. How do you get over something like that? One, you could stay upset about it. What, honestly, what is that going to do for you? What do you gain out of being really upset over that? Now I understand paying your dues and respects and things like that. You have to think about yourself in the future. Who wants to hang around someone who's depressed all the time? You do not want to be depressed. Well, that was kind of depressing just thinking about that. <laughs> do things that excite you, hang out with people that you love being around. Do not be depressing. Don't be mopey. Honestly, I'm really sorry to say it, but here's the truth. At the end of the day, no one cares. The internet doesn't care. Now, obviously, hopefully your family and your friends care, but do you honestly, do you honestly think they want to be hearing about that all the time? I want to hear about your problems, but you do not need to be repeating your problems about it with me. You need to be striving to be bigger and better and greater about this all. I'm not kidding you. You need to be thinking more than about yourself. You need to be thinking bigger than that. You need to be thinking about those around you. How can you use this depression, channel it, and help other people who struggle with it? How can you help someone with that? That's the way you need to be thinking about this. 
How can my loss be someone else's gain? How can I be helping someone focus on the future? How can I keep them motivated? Watch things that make you happy. Uh, watch things that make you laugh. Watch and be around people and with all of this positive energy, there are a lot of different things. You know, do yoga, meditate, whatever it is. What, something that gets you in your happy place and focus on all of the good things. Honestly, think about everything that you have made in your life. Do you struggle with some kind of a terminal illness? Do you have AIDS? Do you have cancer? Do you have Parkinson's? Do you have something like that or do you not? Are you honestly a blessed individual in life where you don't struggle with something like that? Do you have all of your limbs? And I know that's really kind of funny to think about, like, yeah, yeah, I got all my limbs. But think about it. People who've been amputated. Think about, you're watching this video right now. You have access to the internet. That's awesome. Like, that is seriously cool to think about. Like, how privileged are we? I was just complaining because I spent $20 on this, on this, on this, on this, on this. What am I talking about? I don't even know what it's called. That's such a first world problem. I'm getting upset that I don't even know what it's called. A dash cam, a window cam. I don't know. <laughs> Seriously, get over yourself in the way that you're feeling down about yourself. Now, I understand if it's an actual problem and you're struggling with it, you have to be striving to be better. Do not lie to me and say you don't deserve for it to be better. Do not lie and say you won't ever get better. You know what will happen when you say that? Having that kind of a mindset is so powerful. Drawing that negative energy into your life, push that out, push that away. You have to move on, you have to. That is your only chance at success in this. Do you honestly believe if you lay around and mope all day and night that you're going to progress and get better? Talk to other people who, who have gotten out of depression or who handled depression well. Watch my videos. <laughs> you wanna talk about a good joke? <laughs> Hopefully was, this was kind of somewhat helpful for to you guys. Can't even speak English. Seriously, I know I mess around a lot. And I hope some of this was helpful to some of you out there. Let me know if you like this below. Share this video if someone is struggling with depression. Share them, help them stay motivated. Sleep one hour less per day and be more productive. Sleep an extra hour per day and see how much more productive you are by having more rest. Do something that gets you motivated. Watch a video that gets you motivated. Go out, start working out today. No, it's 11 p.m. at night. Well, you know what you can do? You can start doing some push-ups and working out at home. You know what? You don't have to be eating that ice cream right now. Put that down, you fatty. <laughs> Thumbs up if you're a fatty eating ice cream watching this video. <laughs> I'll probably be eating ice cream editing it. Seriously, I love you guys. Again, share this video if you did enjoy it. Uh, like it, subscribe if you're new around here. And thank you so much for watching. This is Z McQueen, repping the Motivational Monday scene. You need to get out of depression, start working on it today. Scene, and I can't wait to see you in the next video. Oh, this guy wants to race, huh? Well, I ain't gonna race him back. I don't have enough money for a ticket. I, I just, uh, oh, should I? No, I am not. You're as calm.